So let's look at how these numbers translate to a real tire. This tire doesn't list P or LT, so it's a passenger tire. The 265 means the width is 265 millimeters or 10.4 inches wide. Then we have the aspect ratio. This number represents the size of the sidewall compared to the section width. The 70 in this case means that the sidewall is 70% of the width or 7.3 inches. The R just means radial construction as opposed to bias ply. And the final number, 17, that's the wheel size. Now that we've got the width, sidewall size, and wheel size, we can take all that together and get the height of the tire. We'll take the sidewall size, add the wheel size, and then add the sidewall size one more time. Now that gives us a height of 31.6 inches. Based on our observation, this tire, the 265-70R17, is an excellent choice for several reasons. The larger sidewall height of 7.3 inches provides better cushioning and shock absorption, making for a smoother ride on rough terrains. The 17-inch wheel size is a popular choice for many SUVs and trucks, offering a good balance between on-road handling and off-road capability. Additionally, the overall tire height of 31.6 inches helps in maintaining ground clearance, which is crucial for off-road adventures. This combination of features makes the 265-70R17 tire ideal for both daily driving and off-road excursions.